Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find this video to be helpful, please like, share and subscribe my channel. In this video, we are going to learn how we can create Excel file and after creating Excel file, how we can feed information in different different sheet of Excel file. We can create create a sheet also like sheet 2, sheet 3 and already we have a sheet 1 also whenever we create a file. So in this uh, video we are going to learn how we can uh, do all these things by using Excelize library of Go language. So I just start here to create Excel file. So I just use main function here and for that I need uh, Excelize library so for that I have to uh, in import library also so I say go get and just I paste this github.com uri slash Excelize slash v2 and you have to download this library from the internet. I have already downloaded that's why it's not taking time but if uh, you do not download so far then it will take little bit of time. So library is available now and now I can use this library to create my file. So I say f equal to excelize dot new file. So here I am creating a file and I save it. So automatically it will import this library after save. Now this file is uh, created but I am not using this so I am using it now. So I say f dot uh, set cell value so that value I want to set. So I want to set the value in a seat 1 and the uh, range is a1 remember that a1 I want to send cell a1 and here I say uh, a roll number of a student like this. Similarly, I just copy this and I save it and in C21, I want to use here B1 and in place of B1 cell, I want to say student name. Similarly, I just have C1 and I say here course like this. Now I just uh, copy all these three and I paste and I insert the information in A2 and B2 and C2 and the information is roll number 1 and I say the student name is Ravi Kumar. Here I say a taking admission in B tech same just I copy this and I paste it and I say roll number 2 but here now in A3 then B3 then C3 like this and, uh, and I say here Sachin Kumar like this in place of B tech we can say M tech and uh, sheet 1 like this we have then roll number 2 then value then value so like this we can insert the value in a cell of sheet 1 if I want to uh, create C2 also that will also uh, I will display I will just teach you here first of all I just save this file and I say error if there is any error so I say save as and I give here name that my student dot xls x xls file then save it if if error not equal to nil if there is any error so we say fmt dot 
print ln and we just print the error else what we have we display a uh, file saved or file created or data inserted we can say file created and data inserted in ms excel file you see how much powerful this library is a very simple way we have inserted the value under the sheet 1 of excel file that name i am giving here my student.xls and we are just creating an excel file without any so much of tough coding so try to execute it here go run and file is right into excel and i try to run it and you see file created similarly i have the file here student so this file i am going to open in explorer and now i want to double click here you will see that information is coming roll number student course and all information as i am trying to insert the value so information is coming in excel on seat one so i just close this go to code and now you see if i want to insert the same kind of information on c2 also so how what i can do i can say that uh, uh, i say uh, sheet 2 then equal to f dot a new sheet and i give here name to sheet 2 sheet 2 like this and after that i just copy these all information here i save it and uh, uh, this and in place of one i say c2 so this information i am just inserting in c2 like this and now i can set the in uh, the current uh, you can say active sheet also so i say set active sheet and that would be a sheet 2 like this so we save this and remember again we have created c2 also and we just save the file now i try to execute once again once again it will generate a file it will display this information now i run it once again and you will see that two sheet would be there c2 is active because i have set to c2 now c1 is having the same information like this c2 also having information like this so you see how easily i am able to uh, create a excel file uh, in go language using excelize library it's very powerful very simple so much of unique type of code that able to generate excel file without any so much of headache you see so simple it's simpler than uh, you can say uh, your vb script language also in excel we we know that in excel we use vb script to modify the value of excel and to make excel as a dynamic excel sheet so here i'm using the go language library excelize that is so simple than uh, your vb script also so that's all in this video i think you have learned something from this video if you really learn anything please like share and subscribe my channel thank you for watching this video Thank you.